From the Linmar Video and Technology Center, we are LMTV, Linmar Television. A total look at everything happening on your Linmar campus. Linmar, your news starts now. Good morning, Linmar. It's Thursday, April 26, 2012. And here's a look at the stories making news on your Linmar campus. Our top story. That's right. After months of preparation and endless hours of rehearsals, the spring musical is finally here. Joining us to tell us more about the show are today's anchors in training. This year's musical is Into the Woods. It features an all-star cast, full orchestra, a large chorus, and a team of talented technical people to make it all work. The musical intertwines the plots of several familiar fairy tales and follows them further to explore the consequences of the characters' wishes and quests. The main characters are taken from the stories of Little Red Riding Hood, Jack and the Beanstalk, Rapunzel, and Cinderella. The shows are tonight, tomorrow, and Saturday night at 7.30. With a first act matinee, especially for younger guests, Saturday at 2. Tickets are $10 for the evening performances. And $5 for the Saturday matinee. Tickets will be available at the front door. But come early. Seating could be limited. Check it out tonight, Friday, and Saturday in the Linmar Auditorium. David, back to you. Thanks, guys, and welcome to LMTV. In other news, seniors, all CORDS volunteer hours are due to Mr. Becker in five days. That's Tuesday, May 1st, in five days. Any cards received after that date will not count towards your total for graduation. See Mr. Becker with any questions. Seniors, the Marion Times will be running a graduation section with photos of all graduating seniors again this year. Let's make the Linmar class of 2012 well represented. Turn in a senior photo of yourself with your name on the back to Honey Sue in the main office by May 1st. We'll be back with more LMTV news right after this. Prom. It's a night you will cherish for the rest of your life. Preserve those very special memories forever by ordering your very own Linmar Prom DVD. Watch the magic of setup, the always exciting and colorful Grand March, the revelry of the dance, and the fun of the post-prom celebration. What a great gift for your date! Or a special way to say thank you to your parents for making your prom night extra special. Pick up an order form in the main office and pay $10 to Mrs. Dayton. Prom, a night you will never forget. Welcome back. For the very latest on prom, keep it here to LMTV next week. Or check out the high school website. Juniors, would you like to earn money while earning high school credits? Check out the MOC application. It's due tomorrow. Questions? See Mrs. Larson in room F-162. Now, Dylan joins us with the sports. Thank you, David. In the wide world of Linmar sports, varsity girls and boys track will participate in the Drake Relays this weekend. Good luck to everybody. Varsity girls golf will play at a quad meet at Pleasant Valley in Iowa City. Team dismissed at 1 p.m. Varsity Girls Tennis will play at Xavier at 4 p.m. In other sports news, tomorrow, Megan Holgrafer will be signing a let her letter of intent to play volleyball at Robert Morris University. Come to the Media Center at 3.30 and support Megan in this honor. And intramural flag football starts next week. See Coach Forsyth for details and rosters. At sports, David, back to you. Thanks, Dylan. Congratulations again, Megan. From the counselors, qualifying information for the ECHO 20 Senior Award should be in the counseling office by May 1st. See your counselor. Seniors, you can be recognized at Senior Rec Night. Turn in your scholarship and award information. Bring copies of award letters or certificates to the counseling office by Monday. Juniors and sophomores, learn how you can get college credit for some of your high school classes. Ask your counselor to learn more. For more on these stories, stop by the counseling office or check out their website. Now, the Lone Ranger joins us with the Arts and Clubs. Well, thanks, David. On uh, the Arts and Clubs scene, Soda, students interested in going to Adventureland, your money and permission form are due today. Any questions, see Kevin McCauley. There will be a Model UN meeting tomorrow morning at 8 in room E33. FCA will be holding their famous pancake breakfast tomorrow morning, starting at 7.20 in the food court. Everyone is welcome for some delicious free pancakes and juice. Students interested in joining TRI or Teens Reaching Youth, your application is due tomorrow. Any questions, see Kevin McCauley. The, F, the joint FFA, FBLA, and Robotics Award Banquet is Monday night, starting at 6.30 in the Lower Commons.
please contact your respective club sponsor to make meal reservations and finalize your duties and responsibilities at this event. Are you interested in photography, writing, or, and want to be a part of uh, and want to meet new people? Be a part of next year's yearbook to Keem. Come to a meeting Wednesday at 8 a.m. in Miss Middlecoff's room, C-133. That's your club update. City Slicker, back to you. Thanks. Today on Channel 1, Burger King makes a pledge to make their food more environmentally friendly. Find out how today at 3 on LMTV. Now, everyone's favorite part of the show, Dylan joins us with today's lunch. All right, it's a pork tenderloin sandwich with green bean casserole, sliced pears, and a blueberry cake. The other lines will offer macaroni and cheese and peanut butter and jelly sandwiches. Chef salads, pizza, are a la carte items. The food court serves meatball sandwiches. That's lunch. Back to you. Thanks, Dylan. Your Linmar weather calls for sunny, windy, and cooler today with a high of 63. Tomorrow, there's a 40% chance of rain and a high of 51. Saturday, we've got a 50-50 chance of rain and a high of 50. That wraps up today's edition of LMTV News. Remember, LMTV is always available online. Just go to the high school website or check us out on Twitter. For the entire cast and crew, thanks for watching. Join us again tomorrow and make it a great day.